discover how your faith shapes your destiny with Neville Goddard. We delve into the manifestation power of faith to turn dreams into reality. Dive into techniques to bolster your faith and manifest your deepest desires. Subscribe and unlock the secret to turning faith into your most powerful tool for change. In this video, we will dive deep into the intriguing concept of faith and manifestation, and how they can be pivotal in achieving the outcomes we long for. Whether you're new to the idea of manifestation or looking to deepen your practice, this video will offer valuable insights on how to nurture your faith and leverage its power to make your dreams a tangible reality. I promise engaging content, so I invite you to stay with us till the end. If you're new to our channel, don't forget to subscribe and hit the bell to receive more interesting, informative, and useful videos on manifestation. In his book Your Faith is Your Fortune, Neville Goddard passionately argued that faith is essential for success and prosperity. He highlighted the critical importance of beliefs and faith in creating the life we desire. Our beliefs, which are the thoughts and ideas we hold about ourselves, others, and the world around us, lay the foundation of our lives. They shape our attitudes, behaviors, and experiences. When we harbor positive and empowering beliefs, we are more likely to yield positive outcomes. Conversely, if we cling to negative and limiting beliefs, we are more likely to face negative outcomes. Goddard firmly believed that our beliefs determine our reality. He stated that your belief acts as a mold or matrix from which all your experiences spring forth. In other words, our beliefs function as a master blueprint for our lives, influencing what we attract and what we repel. Goddard believed that faith is the power capable of transforming our beliefs into reality. He said, faith is the substance of things hoped for, the evidence of things not seen. Faith is the unwavering conviction that our desires will manifest, even if we cannot yet see tangible evidence of it. Faith is the fuel that drives our beliefs into action. To harness the power of faith, we must first identify our limiting beliefs and replace them with empowering ones. Goddard believed that the key to transforming our beliefs lies in visualizing the desired outcome as if it had already occurred. He said, assume the feeling of your desire being realized and watch the path your attention follows. For instance, if you wish to attract abundance into your life, you must first identify what limiting beliefs you hold about money. Do you believe that money is hard to come by? Do you believe you don't deserve wealth? After identifying your limiting beliefs, you must replace them with empowering beliefs. You must visualize yourself as a prosperous person, feel the emotions associated with that state, and act as if it were already a reality. Goddard firmly believed that when we have faith in our desires, the universe conspires to make them a reality. He stated, faith is not belief in spite of evidence, but rather the ability to see beyond it. For Goddard, having faith means trusting that our desires will manifest, even without knowing exactly how it will happen. Faith acts as a bridge connecting our desires with their materialization in the physical plane. Moreover, Goddard believed that faith is contagious. When we possess unwavering faith, we inspire others to cultivate that same faith. He said, your faith will be contagious and awaken in others the knowledge that they too are infinite beings. By having faith in our abilities and potential, we encourage others to have faith in themselves. Beliefs are not only fundamental in creating success and prosperity but also play a crucial role in our overall well-being. Our beliefs about ourselves and the world around us can empower or limit us. For example, if we believe we are capable and deserving of love, we are more likely to attract positive and enriching relationships into our lives. If, on the other hand, we believe we are unworthy of love, we may face difficulties in establishing meaningful and lasting connections. Goddard maintained that our beliefs are not static, we have the power to change our beliefs and, consequently, transform our lives. He said, the power of change lies within you. All you need to do is revise the concept you have of yourself. To revise our self-concept, we first need to become aware of our beliefs. We must examine our thoughts and question whether they empower or limit us. We must challenge any limiting belief and replace it with beliefs that propel us forward. When we nurture faith in our desires, we align ourselves with their vibrational energy. 
Goddard also posited that faith transcends the limitations of time and space, asserting, faith allows you to peer into the chasm between the visible and the invisible, the spiritual and the physical. With unwavering faith, we can transcend the confines of our physical reality and tap into the universe's boundless potential. However, Goddard acknowledged that maintaining faith can be challenging, noting, faith cannot be taught, it must be apprehended. To have faith, we need to cultivate a deep sense of trust in ourselves and the universe. We must let go of our fears and doubts and embrace the unknown. To manifest your deepest desires, it's crucial to have faith in yourself and your goals. Nurturing faith, even in your most cherished aspirations, is a process that requires dedication and constant practice. One of the initial steps in fostering faith is to identify any limiting belief and replace it with positive and empowering beliefs. This may require deep introspection and reflection to uncover the root of beliefs that limit us. Once we've identified our limiting beliefs, we can begin to challenge them and replace them with beliefs that propel us forward. For instance, if we believe we're unworthy of success, we can challenge this belief by affirming our worthiness and capability to achieve our highest goals. Another powerful way to cultivate faith is through visualization. Visualization is an extraordinary tool for manifesting our desires and building unwavering faith in them. By visualizing the outcomes we long for with vivid and realistic details, we can start to firmly believe that they are possible and attainable. Moreover, it's crucial to take action towards our desires. Taking action not only brings us closer to our goals but also reinforces our faith in them. When we act in accordance with our desires, we're sending a clear message to the universe that we believe in them and are willing to work hard to achieve them. Having faith in our desires is essential for manifesting them into our reality. When we have faith in our deepest yearnings, we align with their vibrational energy. This alignment allows us to access the unlimited potential of the universe and materialize our desires in the physical plane. Faith also provides us with the strength needed to overcome obstacles and challenges that may arise on our journey towards realizing our dreams. When we have unwavering faith in our desires, we're less likely to be discouraged by setbacks and obstacles. Instead, we perceive them as opportunities for growth and learning. When we possess solid faith in our desires, we're more likely to act in an inspired manner towards them. This action, in turn, generates more opportunities and amplifies the manifestation of our desires. Faith is not just a passive state of being, it requires active commitment and constant engagement. To cultivate faith, we must be willing to take risks, step out of our comfort zone, and embrace uncertainty. This can be challenging, but it's also essential for personal growth and profound transformation. A unique way to strengthen faith is to surround ourselves with people who support and encourage our desires. When we're surrounded by like-minded individuals who share our vision and believe in us, we're more likely to have faith in ourselves and our higher aspirations. Faith is a powerful tool that can help us navigate the challenges and uncertainties of life. It gives us the courage to persevere when we feel like giving up and the strength to overcome obstacles that may stand in our way. Faith is not just a religious concept, it's something all of us can cultivate, regardless of our beliefs or cultural backgrounds. One of the most effective ways to build faith is to focus on the present moment. When we fully live in the here and now, we're not worried about the past or anxious about the future. Instead, we're fully engaged with the present, allowing us to appreciate the beauty and wonder of life at every moment. Being present also makes us more open to new possibilities and opportunities that may arise along our path. Another key to building solid faith is not to cling to specific outcomes. It's natural to have goals and desires, but when we hold on to them too tightly, we may feel disappointed or discouraged if they don't materialize in the way we expected. We must trust the process and the natural flow of life, knowing that the universe has a greater plan for us, even if it's different from what we initially envisioned. By letting go of attachment to specific outcomes, we open ourselves to new possibilities that may be even more wonderful than those we originally conceived. Gratitude is also an essential element in building faith. When we focus on what we have and express gratitude for it, we're acknowledging the abundance that already exists in our lives. This sends a positive message to the universe that we're open and receptive to receiving more abundance in all areas of our existence. 
Gratitude helps us maintain a positive attitude and encourages us to look for the good in every situation, no matter how challenging it may seem. In addition to cultivating faith in ourselves and our desires, it's also crucial to cultivate faith in the universe. When we have faith in the universe, we trust that everything is unfolding for our highest good, even if it doesn't always seem that way at first glance. We may not always understand why certain things happen, but we can be assured that there's a greater purpose in action, a divine plan unfolding in perfect synchrony. A powerful way to cultivate faith is through meditation or prayer. Taking time each day to connect with a higher force can help us maintain balance and focus, even amidst chaos and uncertainty. It can also provide us with a sense of peace and comfort that may be hard to find elsewhere, especially in times of adversity. Maintaining a positive attitude and an optimistic outlook is also essential for building unwavering faith. Negative thoughts and emotions can make our journey more difficult and obscure our ability to see the good that already exists in our lives. By cultivating a positive attitude and focusing on what is beneficial and enriching, we can strengthen our faith and attract more positivity into our reality. If you'd like to share your thoughts on this fascinating topic, feel free to leave a comment below this video. And if you haven't subscribed to our channel yet, I invite you to do so now. Click on the bell icon to receive notifications of more interesting, informative, and useful videos about manifestation and personal growth. Thank you for joining me on this journey of discovery and transformation. Remember, faith is the bridge that connects your desires with their manifestation in the physical plane.